Hi, my name is David. I'm here to show you how to activate, update, and use multi currency. First, let's go to company settings. Inside here, under financial settings, we have the multi currency. This is where you enable it and you can update it. Next, you can go scroll down, and under settings, we have currency. Inside here, if you click on the three dots, you can edit, deactivate, and see historical records. If you deactivate, it will no longer show in your transactions. You can also search here. You can click the three dots and you can edit and update the rate. Save. And if you click the three dots, you can see the historical rates. Next, let's go to transactions. So I'm just gonna to go to sell and I'm gonna create a new invoice. Add a contact, add a line item. I can scroll here and see how many I have. The key thing though is the multi-currency option here. So inside here I can select the currency and I can update the currency if I'm required to or if it changed and then I can save it. After that, I can click on get paid. Inside here, I can select the currency and deposit to which bank I want to. I can also go and select a different currency. And I can select the bank, the payment type, reference number, reference date. Inside here, I can see the conversion rate here. So I can update it over here, and then I can click next. So for example, I receive, I can close. Multi-currency can be used in other transactions as well, such as buy, sell transactions under accounting, your debit note, your credit note, your bank transfer, your deposits and expenses. And that's a quick look at how to activate, update, and use multi-currency into Scarabooks.